This is our range of ductile iron semi-lugged knife gate valves. 300, they go from 50 millimeter to 300 millimeter X stock. Uh, they have a 316 stainless steel blade, ductile iron powder coated body, uh, powder coated device for the top frame here, which also has an area which we can put a indicators or micro switches to be from a striker. We have a manual operation up here. Going through here, we've got a bronze bush on the top, bearing assembly. And down here we've got the packing gland which can be adjusted down as necessary. It's a coated PTFE gland that goes inside here which coat which clamps down and does a seal around this area as the blade goes up and down this one here is these are nbr o-ring face inside here and the disc goes down and closes against that o-ring face the trim is 316 stainless steel And you should be able to see the O-ring face inside there, if I just point it out. Down here we have the O-ring seal, which is in a slot, just in this area down here. And the blade goes down over the top, and when it is just about fully closed, it goes into these wedges, <clears throat> which are located in the body, which drives the blade sideways for the last small amount and seals hard up against that face. That's how it gets its final seal. When you start to unwind the, the blade, it comes away from the face slightly, which relieves the, the, the wiping action and the blade retracts. I've now closed the blade, but I'm just going to close it the last few millimeters. You should be able to see as I wind down, you can see that blade now going into the wedges on the other side and that drives it actually home as it goes down over that lineal last couple of millimeters. I'll take it back and see how it releases itself away from the o-ring seal face and then it goes up and it'll now then go up relieving the face as it retracts. This is to stop any wear as much or reduces wear as much as possible on that that face. These are also bi-directional these, these uh, knife gates are also unidirectional. In other words, they can only be put in with a flow from one direction. There's the arrow showing the direction of flow. Flow comes from this side here against this face. And when the loading is on, that face, as it's closing, and when it's fully closed, the force is on this face here, which is pushing up against the O-ring face on this side here. And that also helps seal because the land comes out wider on this part as the, as the blade pushes up against it. 